Alumin and base rails go around the outside of the polygonal framework at ground level, leaving only the door openings. These rails are made up of 3 foot, 5 foot, 6 foot or 12 foot lengths. At the corners, a corner bracket should be placed around the hoop and the aluminium rails bolted through the bracket. At each intermediate hoop, a P-clip is used to fix the aluminium rail. These bolts can be left loose for the time being. Where two lengths of aluminium join, an aluminium joiner should be placed between. Using the black grub screws, tighten in place to hold together. Once the sides of the aluminium base are in place, tighten the bolts to the hoops and to the aluminium. Measure the length of aluminium to go from the corner to the door post. Cut the aluminium with either a hacksaw or a grinder. Smoothing off any sharp edges. Drill a 9mm hole through the door post close to ground level. and bolt the aluminium through the door post using a washer on the inside. Attach the opposite end of the aluminium to the corner bracket, making sure the aluminium are touching. Repeat this process in each corner of the polytunnel.
cut the aluminium on the corners of the polytunnel at an angle, making sure to smooth off any sharp corners. On any sides where a base rail is being used without a side rail, mark the hoop two inches higher and lift the rail to this point. Once covered, the rails will be pushed back down to ground level to pull the cover drum tight. When fitting a cover to an aluminium base rail, U and T profiles are inserted into the groove on the base rail. At this stage be careful not to over tension as the profiles can cut the cover. Once the U profiles have been inserted and the cover is held, insert a T profile to secure it in place. Once the cover is fully fitted, loosen off the bolts inside the tunnel and push the rails back down to ground level, tightening and screwing in place. This will cause the cover to come drum tight. Trim off any excess below the base rail, being careful not to cut the polythene cover. T and U profiles can be removed when the time comes for a new cover.
Premier Polytunnels supply a detailed construction guide with every polytunnel. We also provide a construction advice helpline seven days a week, along with a comprehensive collection of online construction videos. If you have any queries or questions, give the team a call or visit our website for more details.